Google just dropped something wild, an AI called VEO3. And it's not just another model. This thing is like a super intelligent video watching machine. It's been trained on massive amounts of public data. We're talking YouTube videos, captions, movie scenes, you name it. And it doesn't just watch videos, it understands them. Frame by frame, scene by scene, VEO3 can look at a clip and know that someone's running, that it's raining, and even guess that it's part of a dramatic chase. It gets the vibe. But how did it get this smart? Here's the kicker. VEO3 learned by scraping the internet. Publicly available content from YouTube, movies, tutorials, live streams, social media, podcasts with video. It's all data. Subtitles, descriptions, facial expressions, even the vibe of the soundtrack. It uses everything. Google hasn't released a full list of sources, but based on its capabilities, this model has likely consumed more content than any human could watch in a hundred lifetimes. And it's already being put to use. After its debut at Google I.O. 2025, VEO3 has officially rolled out across 71 countries through the Gemini app and Flow platform. Now available to pro and ultra tier users, it allows anyone to generate realistic videos from plain text, complete with synchronized audio, dialogue, and cinematic visuals. This vessel is expected to reach port later this evening. No more closed door testing. Filmmakers, content creators, educators, and innovators are already using VEO to push the limits of what's possible. <laughs> Cash or transfer? Beyond content creation, it's being explored for powerful use cases in education, accessibility, and security. Imagine an AI that can instantly summarize hours of lecture footage or describe an entire video scene in detail for someone who's blind. This isn't a concept anymore. It's happening. The potential is huge. It could reshape filmmaking, advertising, journalism, gaming, and even surveillance. Want to auto-generate realistic B-roll or even full videos just from a text script? That's already happening. But with great power comes, well, a lot of controversy. Because here's the darker side. Most of the internet never gave VEO permission to learn from it. Artists, filmmakers, YouTubers, educators, they've all put content online, but very few imagined it being vacuumed up to train AI. Some argue this is just the next phase of innovation. Others call it theft. And there are real threats. Deep fakes and misinformation could get a serious upgrade. In shocking news, Jake K. Rowling's yacht sank with her on board after being attacked by orcas off the coast of Turkey. With news like this, synthetic video evidence might become harder to distinguish from the real thing. Entire creative jobs, editing, scripting, even directing, could be partially or fully automated. Then there's the privacy concern. If the internet is forever and VEO can learn from it all, what does that mean for our digital footprints? So yes, VEO3 is revolutionary, but it's also controversial, complex, and still unfolding. We're at the edge of something massive. The question is, are we ready for AI that not only reads and writes, but watches, learns, and creates? Because this isn't just the future of search or storytelling. It's the future of how machines understand the world. And maybe, just maybe, how they understand us. Please, don't finish writing that prompt. I don't want to be in your AI movie, please. Let's see some opinions. I mean, man, the acceleration is crazy. Bigfoot here. Bigfoot here. Check my breakfast.